Yo, what's up, Tarnish? It's your boy, B, and we back with another video, bro. In today's video, we're going to be talking about this new hidden dungeon. It's a dungeon that is, you know, well, it's like the catacombs, but it's a spot where you can farm sulfur, and it's hidden, bro. Like, you can get, like, a crazy amount of sulfur here. Like, I'm talking about, I've gotten, like, 200. I'm even, like, in the process of, what the hell is this? I'm in the process of um, crafting my unique, my first unique. And we're doing pretty good. The only thing that I would say for the unique right now for me, it has to be. Let me see. Because I'm crafting the great sword unique. I'm not going to lie. It's, yeah, nah. Great sword unique. I don't know. Just being able to form crowds and stuff. Or I might just go dagger. Who knows? I might just go dagger since dagger is like my main thing. I'm not going to craft that bow. But yeah, this is where I'm at right now. These these two are going to be, you know, a pain to farm, but we're going to farm them. This is easy to buy. Celestial Essence might be, a, you know, a pain. But, you know, if we have enough harvest, we can get it pretty quickly. Emerald, Emeraldite is pretty pretty easy also. And then Amberite, pretty, uh, uh, it's not that easy, but it's, it's something. These these are light. These are light. And then Palmwood. Palmwood is going to be annoying too to farm. But I got to get a lot of those. But yeah, we we're there. We got this the gemstones. Gemstones are the most annoying one. Sulfur is probably gonna be the hardest one. But enough yapping on things that don't matter. I know a lot of you are probably wondering where is this spot at. So all right, on the map. So if y'all didn't know, right on the map, we zoom out. You get this little island right here. And yes, just so I show y'all, there's quest on this island, meaning that you can go to this island. Which is pretty cool. I hope they add, you know, they have a lot of space here. Add more islands to come, you know. Um, so we're going to go to this island. So y'all probably wondering, how do, yo, bro, how do we get there? How do we get across this water? So, boom. There's a turtle mount that you can get within the game by just, you know, just doing the storyline. Just go through the storyline. You'll get a turtle mount eventually. And then you level them up to level 10. You'll be able to swim across with the turtle mount. Or you can literally swim with your character, which is probably going to take you roughly 30 minutes to get from here to there. Or you can have a flying mount and you can fly over to um, this island. There will be a spawn point right here. And there will also be a spawn point right here. The spawn point that we're about to take will end up leading us right here. So let's get straight into it. Damn, I have 3 million. Damn, why did I get 3 million? All right, let's go. And once you get your spawn point, it'll literally be the most expensive one, which is the 2.6. 2,600. I don't know if y'all seen that or not. Because I know my camera's in the way. Oh, I'm so tired. <sighs> All right. Once you get here, you'll see this big-ass pyramid. Now, this pyramid, I don't know if it has a boss in it or not, but I know that you can farm sulfur here. Like, damn near everything drops sulfur. Everything. There's an there's a room above here, but it doesn't, like, really do anything. You can't go inside. So it's just a door. Because at first I thought the boss was up here, but no, it's not. Going here. Um, and you're probably gonna want a flying mount for here, but I'm gonna use my ground mount for now. We're gonna use a ground mount for now. So we're gonna you feel me leave this. Cause I know majority of y'all are probably gonna have ground mounts anyway. Oh my god. Yes, these guys are tanky. And this these guys stun also, as you can see, he's doing pretty decent damage for just one NPC attacking me. But I also do a lot of damage too. You feel me? Oh, I, look! Look at what I got my blade at, bro. I got it at seven. I can. I, I have you. I got y'all with a video. I got y'all with a video. Don't worry, chat. Don't worry, chat. I just remembered. I got it at seven, and that was like a. I don't know. I was just mad hype that I got a legendary to seven. But yeah, so as you can see here, bro, this is why you need a flying mount because literally you have to parkour down a lot in this, in this, in this catacomb. And there's a lot of legendaries here too. Like I'm talking about an absurd amount of legendaries. I've, I, bro, there's so much legendaries here. From just opening, from just opening chests, bro, I got, I had a hundred something, but I, 
I sold a few, as you just saw. You know, some people were buying keys. I think somebody just bought all the keys, actually. That's why I have so much money. Because I was selling them for 50000 50 50k, 50k a key. Which is, you know, it's not a lot. But you can get a decent amount of keys if you're a high-level player. It's a decent price. But yeah, you come down here, you open chests, you get more NPCs, and then yes, it goes even further down. But if y'all want to see more on the catacombs, on, well, not the catacombs, what do you do this? Ancient pyramid. If y'all want to see more on the ancient pyramid, bro, let me know in the comments down below, and I'll let, and then I'll walk y'all through it. But I'll probably end the video off here. Because I don't want to spoil too much, but I'm just letting y'all know that this is a thing. The catacombs is not the end. The ancient pyramid is the next stop for y'all. For those higher levels, people are trying to get 70 and up. This is where you need to be farming. This is where you need to do what you need to do. Now, I, I well, since I just hit level 60, I want to test out this theory. Because I think that when you're a certain level, like let's say you're fighting a 50, mm, a 56... Like, if something is higher level than you, then it gets, like, a, you do less damage to it by default. But if you're on the same level, you know, or higher, you do way more damage. So we're about to test that out right now. I'll say this, though. I'm doing way more damage, bro. Way more damage than before. And, yes, the bow, the bow, the bow is broken. Like, I have a legendary bow. I'll, I'll show y'all. I'll showcase this for y'all, too. Boom. Boom, poison, does a decent amount of damage. And this is a level, uh, what? Yeah, we do. And as you can see, you just got sulfur. These, all these guys drop sulfur, bro. And they drop a lot of sulfur. Like, hold on, let me click on this guy. You see, wait, yeah, he drops sulfur. He drops three. He drops um one to three sulfur. These guys drop even more. This guy drops five. Wait, no. He drops four to five. I, damn, why did I get five? Oh, yeah, I got a drop increase. You know, five to four. So, yeah, it's pretty... They they, they did a pretty... This this post, this whole thing. Sulfur. This, this is the best place to farm sulfur, bro. But, yeah, bro, I'm going to leave the video off here, bro. Brush your heads. Take care. Catch you on the next one, bro. E cause out. Yeah, I think that's about it. Oh, and for those of y'all that was trying to join my clan, bro, the Discord link is down below. Y'all can join it. We have currently, right now, we have 2,500 some members. So if y'all want to join my Discord, y'all want to have a conversation, that's the best way to join. As you can see right here, we have a lot of members. Our guild has been growing pretty fast, actually. Um, Let me see, clan. Yes, you have to be active. We currently have what? We have 12 members. We have 12 members, and the weakest one, the weakest one right now is level 20. Everybody's actually pretty high level, as you can see here. We we all farm, and we all could help, and we, we all do what we do. We all do what we do. Me saying, you know, I have to be higher than everybody, bro, you feel me? Being that I'm the, the guild leader. Stuff I gotta I gotta be able to provide, you feel me? Alright, enough yapping. Brush your ass I was just trying to get my eight minutes. Brush your ass, take care, catch you on the next video. Ease out.